Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Got a little more work done to it. Uh, notched that uh, bracket for the uh, intercooler. For the uh, stretched stock location intercooler. Um, I already primed the oil. I uh, primed the fuel system. I set it to 43 pounds of fuel pressure but then it drops to like shit 15 I don't know if that's uh, probably have a leak somewhere it's not right here though in the front so it's probably by the fuel filter or by the fuel pump again I, I don't know um, The battery, uh, it's not hooked up yet, just the positive side. Uh, I'm gonna see if it turns on first, then I'll finish her up. You know, hopefully, she turns on. Uh, I got all the sensors on already, uh, except the mass airflow sensor, which since I have the SD2 chip. Um, I don't think I need it, but uh, we'll find out. You know, otherwise, I'll hook it up and uh, try it again. I mean, I'll just try to turn her on for a little bit, and uh, since I don't have any coolant, she won't be on for for too long. I got all the. Uh, Vacuum hoses hooked up, uh, except that one right there, but I put a, a check valve so I won't have a vacuum leak. I make sure I put it the right way. It's a check valve. Spark plugs are on. Uh, they're gapped at uh, 30 to 32,000. Thousands of an inch. Uh, hopefully, she turns on. I hooked up the uh, for the cruise control, but I'm not worried about that right now. Uh, I'm gonna try to crank her up. I mean, she won't turn on, but I'm gonna try to build up more pressure, and then I'll put the. Uh, the fuse for the uh, hot wire kit there's a fuse right there then I'll put that on and we'll find out all right guys take care bye, -bye.